Hello student. In continuation to my last lecture, today we are going to discuss about multi-attribute decision making methods in which we have already covered elementary methods. In elementary methods, we have discussed about dominance relation and even swap method. Today we will discuss about lexicographic method under elementary methods. Lexicographic method. To understand this method, let us consider an example in which decision maker has to select a car out of four possible options available in the market. Those cars are named as car 1, car 2, car 3 and car 4. These are known as options and alternative and the attributes are price, fuel efficiency, comfort, looks. So how to use lexicographic method? We'll see step by step. Yeah, here one more thing. Comfort and looks are given in, in terms of linguistic terms like good, excellent and average. Average, good, excellent, like this. Step 1. First step is to rank the attributes in order of importance of the decision maker. In this case, the decision maker has decided price as the most important attribute, then he is looking for comfort, then after he is looking for looks, and the last preferred attribute is fuel efficiency so to rank i have ranked them with their scale of 1 to 4 4 is the number of attributes so that will be the last so to do that we will give the the first which we want the most we will give 1 then the second preferred attribute as 2 third preferred attribute as three and the last preferred attribute in this case four is the last preferred attribute so that is given as four this is the first step so ranking is done step one is completed step two in step two we compare the alternative on the most important attribute most important attribute means the attribute with highest rank here highest rank means rank 1 or if you are working in terms of weight then the weight should be highest the highest weight attribute so in this case we are working for rank so the rank 1 attribute is price so compare the alternative on the most important attribute so first select the most important attribute so we have selected that is price so price is selected now under the price column this see which option is giving most preferred value most preferred in case of cost most preferred value is very less value because we are working with the cost attribute price is the cost attribute so the less lesser the price most preferred the value so car 4 is selected why car 4 is selected because it's giving us prefer preferable value that is 3.5 lakhs other are 10 lakhs 8 lakhs 4 lakhs they are higher in price so we have selected option 4 so lexicographic method is done for this example very simple very easy to understand okay one more case may arise let us see what is that. It is also possible that few alternatives are tied for the most important attribute. For example, I have take, considered a different example let, with little change in the first example. Suppose car 1 is having price 4 lakhs, car 2 is having price 4, 8 lakhs, car 3 10 lakhs, car 4 4 lakhs. In this case, car 1 and car 4 for price attribute are tied 
okay and the most preferred attribute is here again price so these two cars are tied so I, but i want to select one car so next so i will go for the step 3 step 3 now i have to select second important attribute for these alternatives so say only for these alternatives okay so now i have i have reduced my subset of alternatives out of four cars i have two cars now car 1 and car 4 so out of car 1 and car 4 i have to look for the second preferred attribute that is the attribute with rank 2 so rank 2 attribute is comfort in case of comfort i have to select i uh, i can see that car 1 is having good car 4 is having average comfort level so which is bad which is good which is best out of these two so obviously good car 1 car 1 is having comfort good so i will go for car 1 so car 1 is selected this is how we work in lexicographic method in next lectures we will discuss more about elementary methods okay till then 